Okay, then. Okay, they've changed the controls since the beta. Interesting. Yeah, that may take some getting used to, but okay. Oh, I can I bring that guy over? Ah, oh, it's out of range. That's disappointing. Oh well. That's not good. Oh, very nice positional audio. I hadn't noticed that actually. say I was part of the beta and I still like despite playing pretty much the entire beta um, I'm still not quite sure what the little collectible things are for like the, the little glowing wing things I'm not entirely sure what they're for I know they like unlock something but I actually get that pretty well hidden so props to, uh, props to two drugs on that Is anyone actually watching this? I don't know. Oh, nice, they got the, the feathers to show where you've been. That's cool. Okay, that is Mapstone, I think. Yeah, there we go. 
Okay, so you, you can see where I've been. Um, that's the, the world map. Pretty cool. I, I like that they added the feathers. It was a little bit sort of confusing as to uh, as to where you were and where you'd been before. So good improvement there. Right. Why is that bird there then? Let's grab his attention. See Toki's dropping the little water droplets. Makes the uh, damn it! Oh, so close. Makes the uh, the dead grass grow, which is an interesting mechanic. It's sort of not immediately obvious, but um, yeah, very very cool mechanic. I like it. Uh, oh, I think this is a secret path. I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back just so I can sort of go through the uh, through, through the uh, sort of I don't know, I guess intended route. Uh, I, I will explore that a little bit later on, maybe. It's one of the things about the, the game, it's sort of. It's open world and there's a lot of different routes you can take through it to get to the end. Um, so, so I'm just going to take sort of the the, sort of the easy, obvious route. Um, or at least the, the route that seems most obvious to me at the time, I guess. So, let's go for that. little Toki waving in the background. So, sort of, you, you make your way through the game by uh, by whistling and stomping. But if you you know if you get stuck or there's something special you need to do, then you can play these little melodies and help achieve things. And I think, uh, yeah, there we are on the poor screen. There you can see the uh, the reset melody. So that's cool. Uh, yeah. Okay. Wow, seven viewers, that's more than I've ever had. That's pretty cool. Okay, so pull that guy towards. Ah, uh, yeah. Makes sense. There we go. This Okay, this wasn't in the beta, that's new. Anything over there? Ah, oh, nope. Oh, I see. All these guys are over Whoops. Um, there we go. <laughs> cool. All those very nice animated water and everything in the background is very, very cool. Incredible. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna up. Sorry, Barry Bug. It was, it was for the best.
a lot of these, you, you'll notice I'm sort of speeding through these earlier puzzles. Um, the majority of them were in the uh, in the beta, so I just sort of memorized them from playing them so many times. But uh, once we get a bit more sort of yeah, once we get a bit deeper into the game, I'm going to actually get stuck in your in your, see me actually figure things out. So it'll be fun. Hmm. I, get, I get the feeling I'm supposed to. If I want to go up there, I'm supposed to bring back a berry bug from earlier. I think, I'm not sure. I'll go back to that later. But yeah, that's sort of the uh, the early introduction to the light dark mechanic, and I, I love the way his eyes sort of glow from sort of from tearing the game to bits, as as I enjoy doing. I, I know how they did that. And it's very very cool stuff. I like the eye glow on that. So that, that's sort of the official, like the, the sort of the expected introduction to the uh, the water mechanic. I think. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they reversed the controls from what they were in the beta, which uh, kind of a little bit annoying, but I guess they have the reasons for it. What's that guy doing over there then? I get the feeling I'm gonna to have to bring a berry bug back here with a, with a bird, and then you know, this guy eats it. Maybe I'm not, I'm not sure. I'll come back to that. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, I have an idea. Let's try this. Back up here, because the uh, the birds react to if you uh, if you whistle near them and then they uh, they follow you. So I think I might be able to drag one of these birds down there, maybe. Yeah. Spam that and see what happens. Come on. There we go. Yeah. See, the mini birds can't pick up uh, Toki Tori because they're too small. They don't have the strength for it. But, uh, they can pick up the berry box. So there we go. And if we just pop back up here. And back. There we go. Right. I think I'm going up there. I'm not sure. Let's try that. There we go. Wow. Okay, so that's the alternate route from the, uh, the darker area before. That's, that's going to be a bit harder, so I will... You know, I'll give that a go later. But as I say, the whole multiple routes thing, so... I will come back to that another time and just sort of stick with the, the easy quotes. So, sort of, yeah, the, the easy route. Yeah. Behind the grass, and then around here. Aha. What's this? I have a feeling that's going to be of some relevance later on. So that's a door, but what's with the bird? I want to see what he's up to. Hey, what portals? Yeah. 
Do you want me to bring him this way, maybe? There we go. Use him as bait. There we go. Mm, ah, I have a feeling I'm supposed to bring him over as well. There's something I'm missing that will occur to me later. Stop it. Let's just, uh, yeah, let's go back to the door from earlier. I'm sure there's something interesting up there. But, uh, How do you get over... Jesus. If you hadn't guessed already, I'm playing with an Xbox pad. Because, uh, I, yeah, I don't know. I prefer, I prefer, it feels more comfortable than a keyboard for this kind of game. So, uh, pick those up and then the other way. That's the door we just came from. thing that bugs me is the, the frog can see behind him for like one or two units of, of space. Minor thing, but uh, Okay. So I, I don't know how well this is coming up on the stream, but this is full, you know, I'm running full 1080, I think the stream's 720, and it's Flawless, um, flawless 60 frames per second. So, you know, props to Marco, who is, uh, from what I gather, in charge of all the uh, optimization on that end. Alright, see if I can do this without dying that time. Anything up there? Looks like it, maybe? I don't know. Okay, so avoid the electric slugs. Lesson learned there. Nice chilled out music, I like it. I have to say, the, the backgrounds are beautiful. I don't, I don't know how well they come up on the stream, but... Uh, absolutely gorgeous. Huge props to the, uh, the art department. Right. There's going to be something out there, isn't there? I bet you there is. 
No, 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 no. Damn it. I'm going to reset a bit. Alright, set up here. And try that again. Okay, so it saves the, uh, the map stone. That's nice. The, uh, the berry bugs won't walk off platforms, but the uh, the frogs will. If you need a berry bug to go off a platform, you have to stomp it off. Okay, can't go left or I will die. Hmm. Okay, there's a nest, there's a bird. Let's... Yeah, there is something down there, so there's got to be a way of like distracting enough of the birds at the same time to, to sort of to get past that. I can't really. Um, I, I didn't need that at all. Throw the berry bag off here and see what happens. Mm. Okay, so that keeps the berry bug up there. And he's asleep. How is he asleep? Say section complete and uh, okay. 
So into the caves we go, I think. I actually had a discussion with the with the devs about this. That's that's not actually ice. That's crystal. Because apparently ice floats. Who knew? Never would have guessed that. Uh, damn it. Damn it. No, 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 no way out of here. You can't whistle underwater. You can stand quietly. Uh, yeah, I died. <laughs> really should have thought about that one first. And before I go there, then whistle here, grab the coffee bag. Uh, ah, there we go. There we go. Really nice and light. I've got a game for what I've Because I played the beast, and that's not what I'm supposed to do, is it? Uh, there we go. Oh, I broke the coffee bar. Now he's just stuck upside down. Pipes there. I'm, I'm guessing that's a bit of a, a throwback to the, the sewer section from Toki Tori One. Probably. Seems like the kind of thing that they try to do. Seems like their style. Okay. Into the... Oh, blimey. Uh, there we go. Light box. And I think they go out again. Yes, they do. Yeah, th th those guys are evil. I'm, I'm not going to touch them because... That's just probably going to hurt a bit. Okay. Uh, no easy way of getting up there, but I'm sure there's something if you can manage it. And what are these? Is this the... I, th I think that's the, the molehills for the, for the mole they added. So... Uh, that might be useful. It might be. Uh, ah. Diagonal line across the checkpoint it means I can't call the map bird. Something I haven't actually shown off yet, which I probably should have. There you go. Oh, there's got to be something up there. How do I get a bog up uh, there? How do I get a frog up there? Yeah, there's, there's quite a few sections which seem like it would be, uh, I have to get, use a frog to move another frog. Sort of, they move together. It forms a, a wider radius. Okay. I can't move through the stairs. Okay. Okay. So if I'm in dark, because they can't see where it's coming from, they can't do anything. If I'm standing in the light, they pay attention. Now it's going to become very, very important later on. For some reason these guys, just, despite the positional audio in the game, these guys can't tell left from right. Uh, uh,
Okay, the frog gets stuck there. So we've got to find it getting some light into the area so that they'll look through. bring the flies with me by whistling, but apparently whistling breaks the bubble. Okay, so, so the glow flies actually go away and they sort of, you know, they go directly away from you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a uh, that's a molehill for the for the mole they added because I don't remember seeing that in the beta, and I know they added only recently. Uh, there we go. 
I'm just checking to anybody who's actually watching the stream. Is the, uh, like the audio... Damn it. Is the audio balance okay between my voice and the game? Is that, to me it sounds like the uh, the music might be a little bit too high up, but uh, yeah, I'm not sure what you guys think. I know from experience what those bats are about to do, but let's do it anyway. Yep. Yep, they go and kill everything. Didn't know that, uh... Yeah, there we go. Okay, yeah, music is a little bit loud. Let's fix that. Hopefully the audio is a little bit better now. Oh, got some steam training cards. Beautiful. Right. Hopefully that's a bit better. Hopefully you can uh, hear me now. Uh, a little bit better. Right. Okay, so let's not make that same mistake with the bats. Okay, okay, water extinguishes the glow flies. Okay. Ah, oh, but you can relight them off each other. Clever. Oh, damn it. Okay. Yeah, if you move multiple glow flies near each other, it widens the, uh, the light radius, which is what you have to do there. Nope, 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 nope. Damn it. So, I've got to get... If I want to go up there at least, which yeah, would be quite nice too, I've got to light the glow flies. There we go, without triggering the bats. Lovely. I'm guessing it's like a secret area up here. Yes, it is. Okay, I think that's I think that's like a special jingle for you found a secret area, uh, much like uh, Zelda games of old. Uh, right, bring these guys through. The water will put them out. That will light them back up again. Come on. Lovely. I don't know how necessary it is to bring the, uh, the glow flies through here, but might as well. Might be important. Oh. No, that's... Hold on. Can I stop it? Yes, I can. Can I then pick it up? There we go. Aha! Gigantic radius of them. No. There we go. Okay, so if like one of them goes through, but you can still re relight off the others straight away. Nice.
Hang on a minute. Let's just go back through there. Colours seem a little bit muted here. It seems a little bit more sort of greyish than uh, than normal. I think that's the uh, the colour grading at play, which is uh, pretty cool. No, uh, fine. Uh, the birds annoy me. Oh hey, there's one. No. Oh. Okay, there's got to be a trick with getting a frog or s There's got to be a way of getting up there. There's no way that that's not a secret path or something. There we go, much more vibrant. And we're back outside. I don't even need that. What do I... And there's nothing up there that I can see. Unless... Oh, there's two frogs. So we send another frog up. And hope that he doesn't make it... Oh, uh, damn it. Oh, hold on. Send the berry bug first, that's it. No, 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 no. Damn it. Oh, now I can't kill him. That sucks. It's... Can, I, can I just send him through the, the edge of the level? Does that... No, he's going to come back. There we go. Oh no, it's dark. Mm, okay, let's just reset that. There we go. Uh, okay, so we got that. See if this works. Okay, and the berry bug is not going to fall down. But now I can't spawn another one to get the other frog or anything else up there. <laughs> hmm. I don't even know if there is anything up there. I'm just sort of clutching at straws and, and doing a bit of guesswork. I'll come back to it. Away. Oh, there's the other very bug I meant to use. Now, ah, oh. but I can't get him past this. Hmm. Oh! Oh, I get it. I use one of these frogs in this berry bug to get the other frog up there so I can use that berry bug to get to the checkpoint. Now it makes sense. Alright, bring him this way. Splat. There we go. I was overthinking that. Completely overthinking that. Smack. Again, the, the frog seems slightly behind him. That Irks me a little bit, but I'm, I'm, I'm not going to mark them down for that, so to speak. <laughs> no, that's... I like that. Secret tunnel? Yeah! Secret tunnel. Ooh! Ah. Oh, it's the, the dark room for developing the photos from the... The Tokidex, the melody for which I don't know yet. Is it? Is there a melody for it? Is it? Oh, it's just... Oh no, it's a melody for the camera, I think. Yeah, that's it. It's a melody for the camera, which I haven't figured out yet, but there we go. Um, so I'm guessing that these will like, show the, uh, the pictures as and when I've actually taken some, maybe? I don't know. Okay, trigger buttons are stomp as well, what do you know? Yeah, move that out of the way.
Okay. I don't know if you can see that on the stream. But over to the, you you can see little glowing icons of the uh, of the wing symbol, in the in the diamond that we saw earlier when I, uh, with all the uh, with all the pickups. I don't know how easy that is to see on the stream actually because I'm downscaling a little bit. But uh, so I'm guessing that's showing like places where I can deposit the uh, collectibles. I think. I don't know. We'll find out later. Right. Smack. Interesting water physics there, but there we go. Water's never been fun to code. Well, it's been easy anyway. Okay. Uh, they redesigned the doors as well. That's interesting. And pretty, they were a bit more blue before, I think. Um. I don't do this. Uh, can I? There we go. Okay, so I can move him, and we can drag him through the door. Just stand under the door so we don't squash him. Smack. Okay, yeah. So the bird picks him up. I whistle near him. There we go. Coffee bug gets that. Thank you guys for redesigning that section. I, I, I remember not being a fan of that bit before. So, yeah. Right, underwater. Very slow moving. And you've got a limited air supply, which is always a fun thing. It's... See if we can get that without dying. Come on, 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 come on. Hey, there we go. Hmm. Um How do I do this? So I can't stomp within radius of them, I don't think. Can I? Aha! That works. Yeah, and then I go off and get him to to bubble me across. No, 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 Didn't think that through. Didn't go for a didn't go for a breather there. Good job, Damn it! Nope, wrong button. Reset. Okay, so. Walk along here, go to the other side, get them facing left. Then go back and stomp to make the first one push the second one across. Smack. There we go. Then go back left and take an air break this time. Also, shout out to two tribes who made this fantastic game. As I gather, at least one of you is watching me on uh, on the stream via Twitter. I find that so. yeah. Shout out to you guys. Fantastic game. Love it. And sorry, berry bugs, but it seems like the only way. Oh, this can I, can I get all of them at the same time? Is that is that doable? Whoops. <laughs> Didn't intend on that one. But, uh, is there anything up there? Nope, okay. Right. There we go. Hmm. 
No, I'm gonna stand there. Actually, ooh. Oh, I should have. Reset. Right. Walk through here and stop. It's back. How high does this take us? Come on. Yes! So I'm guessing somewhere in the level editor there must be a flag for, for like secret area or like a, a region selection or something. You can mark a region as being a, a secret so that it plays that noise when you discover it. I will I'll have to look at, into that in a bit. Okay, so... Inflated frogs float. Grab the bubble express. There we go. Hmm, what was that? Long, long, short, short, long, long. What's that to them? Ah, blimey. Okay, can you say so you can see the route that I've taken. Uh, oh, that's interesting because there's a bit over in the caves where you had the black smoke, but I covered up with a. Um, I, I covered it up with the, uh, the the crab, and that doesn't appear to be on the map. So I'm, I'm guessing. If I cover the smoke up with the uh, with the crabs, then it covers it up in the map. Maybe I'm not actually sure. I'm gonna have to test that at some point. <laughs> Press pause to see the location melody. Okay, so yep, there we are. Location melody on the map screen. There was one that they had in a really old beta, and I don't know if it still works. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. No, that doesn't do anything. Oh well, worth a try. There used to be a debug flying thing where I could just fly anywhere. That was pretty cool. Uh, smack. Camera shake, not good. There we go. Actually. Stone. Where are we now then? How far, how far are we? Okay, so from the looks of it, I still got the city, the volcano, the forest in the like, you know the far back forest to go through. I'd, I'd say I've still got quite a bit to go. I think I, I hear on Twitter that I'm racing through the game. So, but of course that's the fun because there's the easy route, which is the, the quick route, and then there's the uh, the difficult route that will take you forever. And how the hell do I? Let's, let's try not to die on that bit. It's got to be a trick to that. Or, or maybe that's meant to be like one way you come th at it from from the left, and that's just to stop you cheating your way up. I guess maybe I don't know. <laughs> I hear disco music muffled to the left. That'll be, that'll be interesting to see. Okay, just juggling berry bugs, why not? Uh, come on, drop one. There we go. I think that's what I wanted to happen. 
Okay, birds can see through and take the bubbles. Didn't know that. Another map stand. That was quick between map stands. Hmm. But yeah, you, you like you can see this. Um, how uh, how do I describe it? The game itself, the two D planes that you see are all like slices along the game world that you can see, like the uh, the paths going left to right. You can see on the uh, on the world map. Those are each one of those is one of the two D planes in the world. And I, I think a lot of people got confused about that um, for, from the get-go, but it's, a, it's actually a pretty elegant system. I like it a lot. So, come on, where's that disco music coming from? Come on. I know I don't need to spam the whistle button that quickly, but there we go. Right. Hello, tutorial bird. Mm -hmm. well, there we go. Toki Tori 2 is, uh, breaks the laws of physics and has a perpetual motion machine. What do you know? No, no, no. no. <laughs> uh, oh, I think I get it. I take the uh, send the coffee bug through the portal, then this way, then whistle, and that'll move the crab. There we go. Okay, I think the whistling is on. Oh, it's not online site, okay. Poor bird. He had a wife and family, he did. And now he's never gonna go home. That's sad. Okay, so okay, I think we're getting near the city now. Yeah, signpost. Wow. Let's just grab the map stone. I think those are called map stones. Okay, that looks like that's going to be sort of a, an additional path across to the to the right. So I'm actually going to explore that now. I'm, I'm curious as to what's over there. Although I have a feeling it's not going to end well because um, no, there's no way I'm going to make that. Hmm. Well, let's give it a shot, see what happens. Probably gonna drown. Uh, yep. I'm sure there's something over there, though. Oh. Does that mean I. Yeah, I lose the collectibles as well. Let's go get those again. If I jump in from here, could I make it, maybe? Oh, hello. Hello, bird. You gonna fly over here? No? Okay. Alright. See if this gives me enough breathing time to get. God knows where. No. No. Not in the slightest. Okay. One more time. We'll grab the collectibles and then head back to the left. Because <laughs> I think that's where, sort of, the intention is to go. Bird's got to be up there for a reason. I can't imagine they'd just put him there without without a purpose. So. What's the coffee bug for? 
Again, I can't imagine they put in there without a purpose, so... Hmm. Ah! Oh, I think I, I think I, I think I get it. Nope. Uh, yeah, I've got to get a copy bug down there, and then... Yeah, that makes sense. But... We've gone and lost the frog. Let's try that again. Right, and I bet you I've lost those collectibles again. Yep. <laughs> See if this works. Yep, there we go. Alright, let's keep the frog over here. And see if I can get the bug down in time. Smack. There we go, easy. In fact, I didn't even need to do that because there's a ladder. Oh. <laughs> Smack. up here, whistle, coffee bug goes, th and yeah, there we go, lovely. I'm not going to squash the coffee bug, I know it's tempting. Ah, uh, aha, uh -huh, water trick. I, I like how they, they sort of they don't seem to have overused the water trick, from what I can see. Like, it's a nice trick, but I can see it would get annoying if you uh, if they put it in too much. So, yeah, I, I think they've actually balanced this very well. Okay, fine. I'll whistle. I've already done this one, but okay. Okay, so wow. Blimey, I am racing through this. What? Okay. So, uh, I'm just trying to see the uh, the flashing diamonds with the wings in. There's one over on the far left in the grass. There is one on a rock near the middle at the top and there's one quite hard to see right at the top of the mountain on the right. And there was I'm pretty sure there's a fourth one, the one that I already filled in, so that's gonna be or or is it only flashing the ones that I haven't done yet? I think that might be it. That would make sense actually, I think, yeah. Okay. So let's go through. Here. Ah, porcupine, I think. Nice throw back to a uh, Toki one. Oh, no, no, no. Covered in spikes, running straight for me. I have a feeling that would not do me any good at all. So I love the music, and I, I got the soundtrack, and this song was stuck in my head for days. Fantastic song, really catchy. I like it. Huge props to a uh, Sonic Picnic for that. Right. Um. What the hell? Blimey, that was okay. Let's grab the map stone. I think that was quite a long travel on that portal. Okay, so I'm... Uh, okay, I've actually... Oh, the portal took me past the entrance to the city, okay. Hello, random gigantic eggplant. That's cool. There's the entrance to the city, I see. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, that's... that's yeah.
It's going to be a trick to getting up there on the right. Um, hello, hello, tutorial bird. Do you want to? Oh, that's just showing me the route. Okay. No, I have a feeling that wasn't what I was supposed to do there. Or maybe it was, I'm not sure. I'm a little confused right now. Okay. Can't get through there without dying. And I've got ports. No, damn it. Does sending the the frog through the portal help at all? Maybe. Oh, hold on. Yes, I think it does. So I do that, and then no, right. Bird picks up the frog and brings it over here, and I spam this to pull him away from the portal. I think. There we go. Pull the that down. Uh ah. Oh. No. Maybe not. Hmm. How do I do this? Right, what have I got to work with then? We've got a bird who drags me halfway across the map. What have I sent? Okay, let's get him through through the portal again. And sure, let's throw the bear bug in as well. No, but the bird's gonna. Gr yeah, bird grabs that. What if I send that through as well? Okay. He'll stick around. And hmm. I never thought it'd be this difficult to climb a wall. Oh, I am actually an idiot. I think I've got it. Or not? No. No, maybe not. Hmm. I think I'm actually stuck. Which is new. That's never happened before. Hmm. Huh. Okay, let's reset and see if I can think about this. Let's 
So what I need is Just swim for Okay, I need to have the bug distracted somewhere. Oh. Oh, I think I've got it. Hopefully. Please. Please be right. <laughs> if this is right, I'll be happy. Right. Alright, let the bird take the frog. Bring this guy across. The frog will teleport through faster than the bird can come back. And with any luck, this will work. Please. Oh, frog. No. There we go. That'll work. I think. No, it won't. Damn it. <laughs> so close. I'm not even sure that's the right way anyway. <laughs> Just got it. I'm not even meant to go that way yet. Or I'm, I'm not sure. No, eight viewers. There we go. More than I've ever had. Again. <laughs> All right. No. Damn it. No way. No. 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 Why is the bird not? God, there's a frog right there, why are you not taking him? Oh, just fine. Yeah, th alright, thanks Matt, shut up. This is Matt for... Just, just, just for the sake of explanation. I, I've got to a bit that wasn't in the beta and I'm a little stuck, yes. Hang on a minute. Did did that just happen? Did that just do what I think it did? Because if it did, that's brilliant. Come on. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. If if you call the if you do the reset song whilst you're being carried by by the bird, then you uh, the the bird's hands cease to exist. <laughs> Right, okay. Okay, well, th well this isn't nerve-wracking at all. I now have the knowledge that there are three developers watching me. So, uh, thanks guys. Um, I am a little bit stuck. I think my dinner is going to be ready pretty soon, so I'm going to have to run off for a bit for that. Um, I think... I'm not sure. My current guess at the moment, right now, is to... Right. Oh, that's going to take me through... Is that... Yeah, can I do this? Yeah, this is my guess. 
Nope. <laughs> oh, and, and, and now I am actually literally stuck. <laughs> I am, yeah, okay, I am stuck. Uh, let's call the map bird, I just want to see. Okay, it is the same melody, okay. They didn't change that from B, so that's nice. Oh, the pickup melody, alright. So from here, I can actually fly to uh, any of the map stones that I've already got, which is quite nice. That's sort of how you get about. Okay, so the one marked in yellow is where you called it from, I think. You can call the, the map bird from the checkpoints, but if you're underground, then you can't, because obviously the bird can't fly into a cave. It makes an amount of sense. Uh, and those ones are marked with a diagonal line to say, you can't call it from here. And I'm pretty sure you can call if you're standing... Uh, like, you have to be standing next to a checkpoint to call it. I think it works also if you're standing next to a map stone. So make an amount of sense. Uh, but yeah, I am actually stuck. There's got to be something I'm missing. Because I've got I've got a frog and a berry bug and me and I need to get up that jump somehow. I've got to, I want to get onto that checkpoint. And I'm <laughs> very, very stuck. Oh, okay, sorry, four developers. Lovely. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I feel popular. Okay, bird doesn't do anything if I'm standing on his nest. Um, okay, guys, yes, I, I am stuck. Uh, Go on, give me a hint. Come on, tutorial bird, you make it look so easy. You just have to fly from there over to the left and you're done. Wait, how, why was... what? That came out of nowhere. Nice of you to, to keep the control points for the, the portals completely out of the way so I can't move them, if indeed they are movable ones, which I bet they're not. Um, hmm. yeah, as I say, I'm not even sure that's the right way to go. Um, not, I'm pretty sure there's no way of getting past that on the left there. I'm not aware of a way of, kill of killing the slugs side, but you know, short of dropping a crab on them, which I can't do. And I don't even know if dropping the crab on them works. But there you go. Force bird to drop what he carries. Okay. I've never actually done that before. But I'm not entirely sure how, but that's pretty good. Right. Oh, I think I get it. Maybe. Hopefully. Let's just send that through. So. The frog will go through on his own because that's what his AI detects. The uh, the bug won't because his AI detects not to fall off things, which is fair enough. So I think I just have to. Uh, oh, the frog's gone and eaten it, hasn't it? Um, okay, let's bring the frog through first. Wait, hang on. 
Damn it. Uh, yeah, there he is. Right. Huh, you can send bubbles through portals. Cool. Okay, so the frog will come through. The bird's going to pick him up, hopefully. And I've got to try and get the bird to drop him. No. And he's in the grass. He can't see him. I didn't know you could do that. I've been playing the beta for months and I didn't know that you could make a bird drop stuff like that. Actually, you did it before with small birds. Oh yeah, so I did. I completely missed that. <laughs> Yeah, that, that's a fault of my inability to play games rather than level design at all. So, uh, yeah, that one's on me, guys. <laughs> and, and no, Paul, no, I couldn't hear you thinking it at me. Much as I would like to be, I am not telepathic. There we go. So I'm assuming... Yeah, that's a, that's a door. I'm guessing a level editor, or I mean, there's some flag to say, don't actually render a door here, just have an invisible thing, or something similar. Never been here before. Never actually got this far in the beta if this was in the beta. I don't think it was. Interesting music. Rumble, rumble, rumble. Uh-oh. Stairs! What's over here? It's just gonna block me, isn't it? I bet you it blocks me. Yep! <laughs> Thought so. Well, here goes nothing. Yep. Tense music. I like that. That kind of looks like a crying face there. <laughs> Interesting idea. Bit too heavy to take off. Okay, yeah, let's get out. Hey, I got an achievement. Apollo 13. Okay, so let's go back down and see what I can do. Well, I'm a bit stuck and yep, stomp's the only option, there we go. Nope, nothing there, worth a shot. Ooh, yes, animated backgrounds, lovely. And yeah, I think I saw. Pretty sure I saw with the uh, with the cart tracks, the f the track that's further back for each of them, like the the rail that's further back for each pair of rails. And that's parallax properly as well. That's really nice, nicely done, nicely done. And death trap over to the left. Good start. No, nothing I can do with that. All right. I will. I'm sure I will learn something later that lets me do that. And a map stone. Okay, <laughs> there's the, uh, was that the bubble craft, I think, just flying about. Ah, yes. Was there another fly back there? Yes, there was. Let's grab those two as well.
No, it didn't squish any. Can you squish them? I don't know. No, damn it. Okay, I can't bring the flies down there. Okay. Actually, hang on. No, even with the flies, there's no way I'm getting past that. Is there? Oh, and I just killed the. Damn it. Hmm. Okay. I'll come back and, and ponder that one later, I'm not. Hmm. Okay. No, 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 no. Damn it. Did it again. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't need those anymore anyway. I don't think. Um. Ah. Oh. So I've got a whistle to get that guy over to move to the left. But at the same... Uh, huh. That's clever. Very clever. I like that. Ah, uh, here we go. Light box. sure if I was meant to do that, but there we go. Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Smack. There we go. I haven't, I've, I've never quite understood the physics of that, but apparently it works, so there we go. This is not going to end well. I can, I can tell immediately this is going to end really badly. Yep. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. Alright, okay. Whistle. Hide. Wait for those guys to go back to sleep. Interesting movement patterns. But, yeah, there we go. Okay, we're all back asleep. And slug pair is now broken, so not going to kill me. Okay. Let's grab a light plug. Damn it. Damn it. I will get the timing on that. There we go. Nope. I've got to smack right like on top of them for it to do the uh, upwards trick. Here we go. I remember this bit from the trailer. I think this was in the trailer. Sure what happened there, but I'm, I'm actually going to do that again because I want to see what happened there. Oh, oh, it's because Togi was wet and it splashed, and water and electricity don't mix very well. Got it. Um. Dead body removal service, thank you. Thank you, Hermit Crab, for that. There we go. Uh, that. And can we get the bug out of here? I'm guessing that's why it's there. Yeah, there we go. Right. Can 
Come on. No, I'll, I'll just wait. That's fine. Take your time. Okay. Oh, ominous music. Lovely. And... Okay. Yep, just reinforcing there that water kills the slugs. Okie doke. Yeah, there we go. Slugs really do not like water. Okay. Also, with, is it just me or are those slugs emitting like wub noises? I think I think they are. Okay. Come on, guys. I'm guessing I need these guys out of here. Oh, I think I get it. So if I get all the berry bugs out of here, they'll distract the uh, the bat, possibly. No, come on, go the other way, guys. Not cool. Not cool. There we go. Uh, let's just move them a bit on. Okay, that should be close enough, I hope. Come on. There we are. Loving the ominous music. Okay. Oh, come on. That, that was just level designer goes mad with power, wasn't it? Also, hello, color grading. That's... Oh, really? Damn it. Okay. So, so somehow I've got to keep that frog from from eating the bug. That should be easy enough. There we go. Damn it! Close. That was that was frustratingly close right there. No. Nope. I'm gonna have to make a blue for real of this. All right, follow the guy down and stop hurrying him. Just sort of wait for him to move. There. No, 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 no. Greedy frog. Okay, you can see. He moves. He jumps off the side and... Come on, 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 come on. Hey! Checkpoint. And I cannot see a thing. This is spooky. Oh. Okay, so I can't go... Hmm. Nope. Um... 
Mm. Okay, down here apparently. Ah, uh, uh, the old don't give them any idea where they're actually going trick. I like that. And here we go. There we go. And back into some light. Hooray. Yeah, I'll just fall off. Why not? Oh, what? Uh, wow. Uh, hmm. What, so it's an island in the sky? Oh. Is is it like a Mario Galaxy thing where they've just taken a chunk out of the ground and hovered it up into the sky now? Oh. Wow. Okay. So so that's like you know the heart of the island and it's bleeding or something. I'm guessing it's something along those lines. Right. So what do I do? Uh, is it I? Oh. Don't know what that did. Cool. Ah, golden frogs. Okay. Okay, so I've got to get the golden frogs into the tubes. Seems simple enough. However, it sounds like my dinner is ready, so I will be back in, I don't know, 20 minutes or so, 20, 30 minutes, something like that. Uh, fun, you know, fantastic game so far, absolutely loving it, and, uh, you know, shout out to, let's see, Marco, Paul, Ilka, and Jerome, who are all watching me from the, uh, from the dev team. Thank you guys, brilliant game. And yeah, I will be back in a bit.